technical explanations. So if the image is real, what about the blackout? Was it a deliberate cover-up? The official line points to something far more mundane, network instability. NASA's live feeds rely on the Tracking and Data Relay Satellite System, or TDRS, which is basically a constellation of satellites that act like switchboard operators in the sky, bouncing signals from deep space to ground stations. Dropouts are not rare. A lead engineer for NASA's Deep Space Network might explain in a technical brief that when a relay satellite moves out of the line of sight of a ground station or passes through a known orbital zone of exclusion, a handover to the next satellite has to happen. Sometimes this results in a handover blank, that classic two-second gray screen. The DSN logs every single dropout with a specific reason code, and according to those public logs, this event was just one of those routine handovers. But for skeptics, the timing of this particular routine glitch, right down to the exact second the anomaly appeared, is a coincidence that feels just way too perfect to ignore. While dropouts are common, one happening at the precise millisecond an anomaly is flagged by monitoring software is, honestly, a statistical long shot that keeps the debate alive.